If you guys are interested in any jailbroken consoles or even unbanning your PlayStation 3 console, you could go over to ungodlyjames.bigcartel.com. It would be awesome if also you guys could follow me on my Instagram, which is at ungodlyjames, and my Twitter, which is at ungodlyjames. I try to answer as many DMs as possible on both of my social media, so if you guys go check that out, I try to connect with as many people as possible. Love you and have a great day. Now, some people may be wondering, well, what are we doing in today's video? Because I didn't read the title and I don't give a fuck about the title. I saw cheats. Where are the cheats? Now, in our top stories, as we could see, they're spotting cheaters already. There's losers like James over there, over there and over there. Apex Legends had an incredible first week since it released. Yes, it did. The game is very fun. I have played it. I think it's very enjoyable. Do I like it better than Fortnite? Yes. I hate when people run from a gunfight even when I was 10 years old and I'd be on like Monarch for two and people were running after I'm just about to kill him. Like I'm fucking so close, dude. Like so fucking close. And they would run. The problem with Fortnite is that went boom because instead of running, people are building and it's annoying and they just keep doing it and doing it and doing it and doing it and doing it. Oh, oh, doing it, doing it. Oh, oh, oh. And it gets so fucking annoying. I love building. I think it's so fun. I think it's such an innovative thing. Is that the correct word? I don't fucking know. But I'm just saying that it was so fun. 25 million players this weekend. Hats off. Not to what I'm going to do to the game. Maybe. I don't fucking know. People are getting shit on for cheating on this game. I always have been spending it pretty good. People shit on people that were cheating on Fortnite. No matter what, you're going to have people that hate on you. But anybody that does cheat on video games knows that. Especially, I'm just going to say, if you like a video game, I, I know I shouldn't have to say this because I say this all the time. Do not cheat on it. They ban you. They ban you hard these days. Hardware ID bans. The only cheats that I feel you're ever going to be able to get on these type of games. Fortnite. Really, you know, good games. We're talking Fortnite, Apex Legends, and uh, what's what's another game you guys like? Rainbow Six. All PC. No PS4, no Xbox One. I, I know a lot of people already know this. I just want to make sure everybody knows this. Apex Legends hackers are already on their way to breaking the game. Nobody breaks the game. I mean, the percentage of people that cheat, I could tell you, is really low compared to the people that just play the game you understand and no matter what skill will never beat cheats cheats always malfunctions you have to understand man-made cheats these are people that didn't go to college these are people that didn't actually get sat down with and they go yo this is a dude that's showing you how to actually create a cheat how to actually code something nicely how to make sure it goes well no cheats all the time they crash they bug out they won't lock that's the thing. I'm not sitting here and making excuses. I'm sitting here and making everybody understand that not all hackers are fucking crazy. You know what I mean? Yes, a good amount of time you will die. Yes, that happens. Not all the time. It's not like you have a 0% chance. You know what I mean? I went up against hackers all the time playing legitimately. Sometimes you can win. Just because they have cheats doesn't make them a god. It doesn't make them great. If you've been playing the game longer, you could probably beat them. Skill. Cheats. Where reports of aimbots are being used to see other players. That doesn't make a lot of sense. That's, you know, but however, though, these people don't obviously know a lot about cheats. It's like ESP and stuff like red boxes. If you guys have ever seen that kind of stuff. So you could see people around the map. I'd assume that's, you know, just like Fortnite and shit. They're just trying to bring it to other games. Uh, hacks are being are by no means widespread and won't affect players on console. Yes. None of these cheats these people will ever talk about, by the way, touch console as we went on just before. Unlisted video exhibits. Why do they have to say shit like that? Highlighting enemies at great distances, detailing their current health as a regular player. There's no real way to preemptively identify a cheater or hacker in Apex Legends. If you repeatedly, if you are repeatedly shot from extreme angles or while most likely in cover, you should be facing off against a hacker. See, this is the problem that I think ruined Fortnite. And I think a lot of people, I, I'm just getting a jump. People can make fun of me, of course, because I think that this is a real thing. Hackers kind of got big on Fortnite because people like, they started watching them. But the problem when people actually highlight that hackers, 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 cheaters, everybody is in this game. These streamers, they use stream snipers as the biggest, biggest if fucking like a get out of jail free card. Hackers as a get out of jail free card. There's hackers on every video game. It should be like nothing else. There's stream snipers and people that watch you that want to be on your stream like anything else. It happens. 
get the fuck over yourself. We're gonna get banned. It's okay. Go throughout your day. Get into the next game. You're not gonna get into it. It's, it doesn't work like that is what I'm trying to say. You're not gonna run into hacker and hacker and hacker and hacker. It's not Modern Warfare 2, guys. It's not. There's no CFG going around. And even then, that game is still playable. There's the infection sheets for people that aren't even on jailbroken consoles. That's what I'm saying, man. Like, and it's still not that broken. People will sit there and be like, I can't play. That's just because you don't want to play it long enough. Back out if you see a cheater. I am able to play it to this day. Sometimes I just want to get on. I want to go to free for all. I want to play legitimately. I want to quick scope. I want to have fun. Whatever, man. Twitch streamer caught aimbotting on Apex Legends remains unbanned. Is this the video? Advertisement. I, I don't want to watch this. Thank you. This is the video. See, these sites like this, man, make me really want to fucking choke myself with a hanger. Why is this in like 240p? Why does... How can you tell that he's aimbotting if it's this low resolution? No way! Wait! No! No, 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 no. Homie, if he was cheating, there's a guy right there. He would have locked to him. Look, still not locked. Now he's looking. Now he's free. Still not locked. Still not locked. He's 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 nervous, so he's all over the place. You could tell. He's not consistently hitting. There's no numbers. Every shot usually can hit. Every other shot usually can hit. By the way, I just want to make sure everybody understands. I'm giving the people that don't understand the information. Still missing. This dude's not even fucking cheating. What, what a bunch of... What a load of shit. See, that's what I feel bad for. That's why I hate... I hate people, bro. They use everybody when someone's actually good at the game as fucking... Oh, I died by a stream sniper. Yeah, you'd be mad too, James, if you were getting killed almost every game. He knew where this guy was, and this is what's bothering me. Look, straight up, straight up, look. Here's him, runs. Right behind the tree. How did he know that? It's just interesting to me. Look, you could have a good pair of headphones and do the same exact thing. That's the problem with these kind of things. That's the problem, because he could be cheating. But probably not really. He is, he's not unfazed by two guys pushing him. They're sl they're not pushing, but they're pushing, you know, they're going in for a kill. Following the accusations of hacking, accounts were identified on the cheats forum using the same username and profile picture that Derry uses on Twitch. As yet, Derry's Twitch channel remains active. Hacking on stream is against Twitch's terms of use. For anybody that is wondering, why don't you go to Twitch and hack? Or why don't you go on Twitch and hack or cheat or whatever? Because Twitch has a big thing against cheaters. They are in favor of the 10 hour voice. And that's what I call them. That is not me making fun of people. But if you would consider that, then I don't give a fuck. The 10 hour boys, by the way, are guys who sit at their computer with their ass imprint in the chair from yesterday, from doing a 10 hour thing yesterday of them consistently sitting there like this all fucking day. They sit there like this. Now, some people might ask, how do you find out if they are part of the 10 hour boy club, all you have to do is listen for these few things that you hear in the next clip. He fucking stream sniped me, dude. How the fuck does he stream snipe me? I don't fucking get it, man. All I do is try and fucking try and I fucking die. If it's not a stream sniper, it's not just a good guy. It's not a guy that's good at the game. No, no, it's a guy that's cheating. And if he's cheating, then he's not doing the game right. I try hard. Look, we're all in it to have a good time, man. I strained my neck so bad that it hurts now. I understand that you don't like cheaters, a lot of you. But for me, I don't give a fuck, in all honesty. I just, I just do not want to be like the 10 hour boys. I don't want to play a game 10 hours a day and fucking hate myself. So many people like Summit even has said, dude, it's so miserable. The game dominated 2018 and whether they were for it or not, most big streamers felt compelled to play it. Now, at the time Summit was playing the game and his stream was doing great, but there was a problem. As the weeks went on and he had to keep playing the game, he got sick of it fast. Like, really sick of it. There's gotta be a different fucking way for me to make it in the Twitch world than go down this fucking Fortnite line, man. It's the most boring shit on the fucking planet, dude. How do you guys like this game so fucking much? It's fucking bonkers, man. This game sucks fucking dick. 
It doesn't suck dick, obviously. It doesn't fucking suck dick. But holy shit, man, this is not an eight-hour day every single fucking day. People are gonna leave after you die because you fucking suck dick, okay? We get it. You can have a personality. That's a big thing. A lot of the 10-hour boys don't. They're known for being good. That's the truth. As soon as people are like, T-Fuse better than Ninja. Everybody started sucking the shit out of him. That's the truth. It makes no sense. Watch the guy you like. No. We have the bandwagon, James. These just look terrible. They look like all the free Fortnite mod shits. Look, I'm not being the Debbie Downer. I'm just being honest. That's the problem. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I look forward to be uploading another video tomorrow so you guys could go check that out. I love you guys all so fucking much, though, man. And I hope you guys have a fucking amazing day, though. Peace out, homies.